Well, I'm pretty much here to uh, provide, um, you know, if they have a question for me about curling, about strategy, if they're struggling with, with uh, something, if they're being stressed out about, you know, they get really nervous before a game, I'm here to help them with that. And uh, I really want to be able to relate to them. Because I know when I was young like that, there was a lot of, I got very nervous for games and it would, would have been very nice to talk to someone uh, who'd been through that before. So I've been uh, going and introducing myself to all the teams, like letting them, a lot of them actually know me. They've watched a lot of YouTube or a lot of uh, Olympics on TV before, so they already know me, which is great. Uh, but I, I want to make sure to let them know I'm here for them. Uh, if they have any, if they need help, if they need anything at all, I'm here. Or if they just want to have a dinner, dinner together or play some games together, uh, that's what I'm here for. And, and we've, we've created a great bond so far. So. And what Some of these curlers have played for five or six years, you know, at least. And I think the level, you can tell, I think there's going to be some future Olympians here for sure. Uh, just, I'm not sure exactly who, but definitely a lot of uh, really good curlers here, so. best thing about the Youth Olympic Games is they really uh, stress and emphasize to have fun, uh, to uh, meet new people from around the world and also to play the game because you love the game and not for the money or the accolades or the credit. You play for the right reason and I think that's one of the best things about the Youth Olympic Games.